Okay, you're free. You're free, mama. Touch you. Something's growing in your stomach. The pain. It's on the side here. Yeah. It's a serious pain. So Jesus has healed you. Thank you, Jesus. Because you can't sleep sometimes. True. You're free. Stand up, brother. You're free. Greet Greetings in the wonderful name of our Lord Jesus Christ, Hi. viewers all over the world. Welcome to Charis Missionary Church. This is our Wednesday life service under the leadership of Apostle JB and Prophetess T.E. Makanemisa. With me here today is my mother, who was located during the service by Prophet Andrew Simono, who ministered upon her life. Ma, please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. My name is Eva Mateka. I come from Lombardy East. Today during the service, Prophet Andrew Simono located you and he spoke upon your life. I'd love that you kindly please tell us what he said and please confirm it. Uh, Prophet Andris, he prophesied me that I have a pain in my side, on my side, yeah. and I confess that prophecy is true. It's been long, I'm struggling, and that, that this pain is affecting my knees. Always when I walk, sometimes I, I feel like I can fall. I, I have to look something to touch, to hold on it, and so that I mustn't fall. And uh, yeah, that is true. And how has it affected you? It's affected me a lot because uh, it's like I'm always, when I want to go somewhere, I feel like I, I don't want to go because of this pain, because it's going, I, I, might, I might fall somewhere else, yes. And Mama, how do you feel that today the man of God located you and spoke upon your life? I feel happy. I'm so, great. I'm so grateful. I'm so much happy because uh, really I know and I believe God, Jesus will heal me. Yes. I greet everyone in the mighty name of Jesus. Two weeks ago, I came to church. It was on Wednesday. Prophet Andris, I'm prophet. I'm prophet. I'm prophet. Prophet Andris prophesied me and say, I have something that is growing inside my womb. The truth is, I would live with pain every single day. The pain would also affect my leg and I couldn't walk properly. The truth is, the first day I came to church, I was also surprised why I'm, I'm no longer the way I know myself. When I got home, I started running to the bathroom unending. That pain is gone. Even now, I don't have it anymore. I would love to thank God for that. Amen. You see, what is happening in Charis now? You see what is happening? Me, I've been faithful in my calling. Now, you can hear testimony here. Prophet Andres prophesied me. Can you see that? A church is not a one-man show. I have to be faithful. God will give another person another one, another one. The faithfulness of the pastor bring forth many colleagues. If you can read about the faithfulness of Philip in the Bible, what happened to Philip? He had daughters, four daughters who were what? Were prophetess. I believe Philip might have gotten the, the haters the haters as ah, four daughters, the prophetess. He might be occultic man. Like here in Charis, people are beginning to say Charis is a family church. Not understanding that it's not only these people that were raised in Charis. 
today we have testimony here. Amen. Amen. Uh, Prophet Andres, prophesy me. Now I'm healed. That's what I was talking about. There have to be other ones also. Andres is a symbol. Andres and Prophetess Tender. They are symbol of others that can come. If, if you're in charis, me, God told me that Tendo will preach and prophesy. If Tendo can preach here, how many of you understand Tendo can preach, lift up your hands? Oh my God. When you say, if we obey you, you bless our children, you mean this? This is what I've been saying to you people. Go say, hey, if you obey me, your children will never suffer. Okay. So now, we have Andresi. Look how I'm working. Now I'm able to relax. 